Asante sana gavana wa jiji letu la Nairobi. Gavana Johnson Sakaja rafiki yangu. Seneta wetu Super Senator Edwin Sifuna. Deputy Governor wana mshiri na watu wa Nairobi hamjambo. Hamjambo tena. Najua sisi watu wa ushago tulikuja hapa tunakuja kama tumenyemelea. Tunaogopa msituambie tumeleta matope kwa jiji yenu. Kwa hivyo tunaheshimu sana. Niseme nimefurahia sana kwa mwaliko wa Gavana Sakaja. Sana sana kwa sababu ya mambo ya kutunza talanta. Na nimekaa hapa nimesikiza kwaya zote. Na mimi wacha niseme ukweli mimi ni mkatoliki. Na kama mkatoliki Na gojea hiyo matokeo itangazwe. Kama hakuna katoreki, hiyo kwa ya katoreki, hizo saba mutafungua. So, si abadhali, abadhali mtu kujisema. Eh, tusiko sana ibule tafadhali. Lakini niseme na vile tumeogea na sakaja kama mimi waziri nikitembea huko mashinani tunaongea mambo ya kahawa mambo ya majani chai mambo ya makadamia mambo ya avocado lakini hapa na robi hamna shamba so shamba yenu ni taranta Na katika ile maleno bao nafanya mambo ya aggregation tumekubaliana kwamba pale Jamhuri Park shamba ya ekari sita jameni inatumiwa kwa wiki moja kwa mwaka na hapo mimi sioni kama ni haki so we have agreed to work with your governor to build that aggregation center not only for products like furniture and other products but also for talents and the creative industry Na mimi nimesema hata mambo ya talanta, mambo ya muziki, mambo ya creative industry is just an export like the way I export tea and coffee. So nitazipa kiwapa mbele katika hiyo maneno. <laughs> na pia niseme sakaja hii jiji la Nairobi ni jiji, jiji muhimu sana. 60% of our GDP come from this city. Population sasa imeenda karibu 5 million. I normally go on foreign trips to some countries with one million people. Sasa jameni raisi wa nchi kama hiyo akiniita na sakaja niite sini afadhali niende kwa sakaja jameni. Because this is my investor number one. Mimi kama waziri wa biashara, biashara number one ni hapa Nairobi. Kama waziri wa viwanda, viwanda number one ni hapa Nairobi. Kwa hiyo mimi ndio waziri wa Nairobi na governor wa Nairobi hapo. Najua sakaja hakuambia kwamba kuna wakati tulikuwa tumesema mimi na yeye tusimame rais na running mate. Sasa shida 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 haikakuja nani atakuwa president na running mate. So sakaja akanipanga, kanipa sasa wefanya hivi. Si umeona hiyo ni Biden na Obama. Na Biden alikuwa mzee kidogo kuliko Obama. Sasa wewe kubali ukuje chini yangu siku moja. But I'm very proud of this gentleman. We have come from very far. Safari yake miaka kumi na kitu tumetembea hapa moja. Vile hako ambia, kuna wakati nilikuwa na mulipa mshahara, 5,000 shillings, tukua hapa City Hall. After 2007 elections. Na siku ingile tukenda pale na Ivasha, tulikuwa na ile mamba ya kuleta hii katiba ya sasa. Boundaries. Boundaries. Hei alikuwa mtu sharp sana maneno ya hesabu. Sasa tukingangana na kinasifu na pale, Sisi tunasema tunaleta prof, eh, profesa wetu. So, kinasifuna na watu wa ODM, wakaleta profesa Udul. Adul. Wa hapa TUK ilafiki yangu. Mimi likachola jama, tukasema hata situ kuna expert. Lakini sababu sakaja wanamjua jina yake, likasema profesa Gashanja, li wanasimamia sisi upande wetu. <laughs> na kaendele ya kakua chama, nuwetu ya chama cha TNA. Na sasa ye, die governor, why the biggest city in the east and central africa <laughs> <laughs>